I like to hike out through the desert and the wilderness and stuff like that, so I need the smallest, most lightweight stuff possible. And in the case of this reflector, I've got a really lightweight light stand. I've got a lightweight compact reflector that cuts down to this size here. But the hardest part, the thing that was always the biggest clunkiest part of all was the clamp the grip head that holds this thing, because you need a really strong one to, to hold this in place when it's windy and stuff like that. So this is a super clamp, but this is what is, this is heavy and it's big and it's clunky. So this is what always bothered me was the grip head. And here's this typical grip head they use in Hollywood is something like this. Again, big and clunky. So I'm gonna show you today what I like to use, I just found that's a lot smaller and a lot more lightweight than this stuff here. Like I've got, you know, in the studio, it doesn't matter if you have big, heavy stuff. Ugh. This is what, uh, you know, this is what people use for grip heads and things like that on light stands. But, you know, this is heavy and you don't want to be carrying this stuff when you're out in nature, <laughs> lugging it around. So, Forget this stuff. Sometimes you have small things that you want to clamp. Sometimes you have big things you want to clamp. That determines the size of the hole. You got like a small hole and a big hole there. But this is metal and it's heavy uh, and it's big. And I want to start with this one here. This is a really good travel one for uh, all purpose. It's, it's, and by the way, if the holes are not big enough, you just open it up and you go like that and then you can clamp something else in there also that's bigger. This part here obviously goes on the light stand, you secure that into place and then this here is for securing whatever it is you want to hold on there. Uh, this is a mat, look at how small this thing is, look at how small this is compared to this. Big difference, and this is not, this is metal, this is, I don't know what that is, but uh, it's really lightweight, it weighs almost nothing and it's super, lightweight and small, which I love. This is a Matthews uh, mini grip head. It mounts to 5 8 inch uh, top stud. It's $30. This is $30. Uh, they have, there's another Matthews thing here. Look at this little thing. Talk about small. I, I, I literally had this in my pocket the whole time. This is a Matthews micro grip head. This is for smaller stuff, securing smaller things, not necessarily onto a light stand or big rods or things, but for smaller things, uh, if you're mounting stuff to a car or whatever, just small things. This is such a cute little thing. It's not cheap though, this is 50 bucks, $52. This is a Matthews micro grip head. But for more realistic everyday stuff, like actual grip head size stuff, this thing is the biggest out of all of them. It's, it, this is more lightweight than this thing. This is metal, this isn't. This is half metal. Look how smaller this is. And this still weighs less than this. This weighs almost nothing. It's amazing how lightweight this is. And it's got all different size holes in it. And this one is definitely more than big enough to handle anything on a light stand. This is a Flashpoint dual grip head for a boom arm. So it's meant for boom arms. So you have one end on a, on a light stand, the other hand is for a boom arm. Or you can put anything else on there. Um, this thing, <laughs> Believe it or not, is only $7.99. That's pretty amazing. And it's made from some kind of polymer, lightweight, carbon, whatever. I don't know what it's made from, but it's some ultra modern, lightweight material. It's super great for a grip head. And it's, it's ratcheted, so it holds in place. You can pick different, whatever size hole it is you want. Like here you have a small hole. This is a bigger hole. Whole, different size hole for everybody here. All right, so this is a Flashpoint dual grip head uh, for a boom arm. And this is $7.99. And it's big, but it's super lightweight. I mentioned before in other videos, remember these? I did this in a recent video where, and I actually use this a lot for reflectors. You screw this on there and then you put your rod on that and then you put your reflector on that your reflector so this thing is also a great grip head mini clamp i'm 
did a video about this already. So obviously I can't talk about that again because I already did. So I'm mentioning other stuff. You can see the size differences between the different models. Um, obviously I like these because I have a number of them and I'm sharing my joy with you. I just love grip equipment, so much fun. <laughs> this is so lightweight. This weighs less than a tennis ball. I could throw it like a tennis ball. All right, that's it. I'll see you in the next video, bye. It'll probably go up to $20 now that I mentioned this video.